Hello. In first part of the amplitude modulation, we learn that amplitude of the carrier signal is varying according to instantaneous value of the information signal. So in that we learn that this one is nothing but the carrier signal which is oscillating with a fixed peak value. Now if we vary the amplitude of this carrier signal according to instantaneous value of this low frequency information signal then we can say that if instantaneous value is decreasing then peak value of the carrier signal is also decreasing after this point instantaneous value of the information signal is increasing we can say that peak amplitude of the carrier is also increasing so here i want to emphasize that this carrier signal which is nothing but the carrier signal before amplitude modulation so this carrier signal with a constant peak is also called unmodulated carrier now if we vary the amplitude of this carrier signal according to information signal then we can say that amplitude of the carrier signal is going to vary according to information signal and as a result we can get the am signal or amplitude modulated signal so in another sense we can say that amplitude modulated signal am signal is nothing but the amplitude modulated carrier signal means we are changing the amplitude of this carrier we are changing the amplitude of this carrier according to information signal so this carrier is nothing but called unmodulated carrier that is before modulation and am signal is nothing but the modulated carrier that is after modulation am signal is nothing but called amplitude modulated carrier signal thank you